All right. Resident Evil 2. Okay, I am going to start with Leon's A campaign. And I think I might run it on the hardest difficulty setting. Because I haven't played this in a good long while. But the instincts take over very quickly. I think I'm going to need to play it on the hardest. To get the most out of the experience. Hiya, Lucas. Okay. Let's look at the results. Oh, look at this. S plus across the board. That is a beautiful sight. I sincerely doubt that I'm going to get an S plus in this. As I say, I haven't done this in a while. So we're going to do Leon. We're going to do Hardcore. Saving requires an ink ribbon. This is only Hardcore by modern standards. That used to just be what you do in a Resident Evil game. No autosave, again. And stronger enemies. Okay. Let's do it. As if she wasn't having a bad enough day. Ah, oh, this is a this is a beautiful game, man. Ruh 
row. Oh, and we got Baby Leon. Alright, so I've got him on the default costume and all that. I guess I could do something fun and put him in another outfit. I don't know. We'll see. Daniel, I just watched Endgame for the first time. That movie didn't really need to be three hours long, just my two cents. Yeah, I, I, I don't know... Hey, you are the guy who thinks The Last Jedi was good. Yes, I am. I thought that was a very good sequel. Very good film indeed. Yeah, I don't know about Endgame's length. Uh, it didn't feel that long to me. So, I guess maybe that's just a Hello? testament to them Anybody wanting it there? to be three hours. I don't, I don't really know what I would have removed. As a matter of fact, I thought more time could have been spent on a couple of things, but I mean, it was three hours, so... I don't know. Poor, poor, foolish soul. Well, I guess it's my loss. Okay, I kind of remember this. I kind of remember this. Stop moving. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir. I got you. Favorite film of the Kung Fu Panda trilogy. I only saw the first Kung Fu Panda once and I don't remember it very well. I didn't like it. Ah, oh, well, thank you, Philip. Oh, shit. Shit. No, no, no. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. No! I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I didn't even make it past the tutorial. There's a way you can just run past that guy, but I didn't remember how to do it uh, soon enough. Okay, I think we're okay. I don't think anything could hurt us here. Maybe that guy back there. I don't know. Claire. Oh, Claire. Don't shoot. Get down. Hey, music lover, how are ya? You alright? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit. Oh, that's trouble. Come on! You know, I'd love to play the original oh Resident Evil 2. But I don't have my PS3 anymore. I often see people in movies declare films to be objectively bad. This seems like a means to stifle opinions that are different from them. Those who argue this want to seem elite. Thoughts? Maybe. I don't know. I used to do the whole objective thing, and I actually believed it. I wasn't trying to disarm other opinions. I just honestly believed that there was objective merit to my opinion. I was wrong. But uh, I wasn't disingenuous. Maybe some people are, though. I don't know. I said this to you in a previous stream. I came up with an alias for you, Daniel Matthews. That's funny. <laughs> Question, you still don't get 2001 A Space Odyssey? No, I am still of the opinion that there is nothing to get. I love this intro. Oh yeah, so they're coming out with uh, uh, four versus one Kind of a, uh, whatchamacallit, Left 4 Dead type of game. 
in the Resident Evil universe called Project Resistance. And I was invited to try out the beta, and I did, and it's kind of okay. I remember in a lot of your reviews you would say this movie is not about anything. Yes, I did say that quite a bit. Damn it, I didn't catch The Last of Us stream, a game I love, but catch one for a game I've never played. Well, damn. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't care for The Last of Us, man. I don't really want to stream it anymore. Daniel, you haven't seen The Room for director Tommy Wiseau. That movie's objectively bad because it wasn't well made. Maybe so. I have, not, I have not seen the film. You need to study visual rhetoric. It will help you get the movie. Well, maybe so. Maybe I will. I don't think that you should have to study visual rhetoric in order to understand a movie, but maybe. The way you said that used to make me laugh. <laughs> yes, quite so. It's a hell of a good uh, recreation and reinterpretation of the original game. But this is really making me want to play the original. I have seen a few silent films, uh, John. Uh, Metropolis being the most obvious one. Uh, I think it was something called like The Omen. It was about uh, death as a character. Have I watched the Fantas the Fanatic? No, I have not. I've never even heard of it. Oh crap! Here comes trouble. Holy shit! There, get out! Get out now! Yeah, they changed that a little bit. The truck driver had turned in the original game. When movies are made that turn out badly, do you think filmmakers are often aware of it, or do they sincerely think their movies are good? Uh, well, movies good, movies become bad for any number of reasons. Sometimes it's on the director, sometimes it's on the writer, sometimes it's on the studio. Studios have all these demands and they make changes. Sometimes it's just down to the editor. Um, I don't think any director knows. Uh, Claire! Claire, you okay? Sometimes he will get a bad movie and the director will think it's good. I think yeah. I'm all right. How about you? most of their most of them are, are genuine. Objectively bad exists it yeah, just Stop most of the people on the internet have no idea what they are talking. Maybe. I'll be there. This is out of control. Get away from me, get away from me. Now this little bit right here was re very, very hard in the original Resident Evil 2. They just... Uh, this is why, what I loved about it, they just dumped you on the street. And it was like, here you go, fuckface. But you actually had zombies attacking you. It was very difficult to get rid of them. A lot of people died in the first, like, ten seconds of that game. It was great. There it is. Oh, that's beautiful. Fuck off. We made it. I'm horrible at the Resident Evil games. Oh, it's my, it's my, uh, it's my whole gaming world, my friend. Hello? Is anybody here? What do we got going on here? And it's period specific too. This is a very old laptop with a very old uh, UI there. I don't think you get this kind of clarity in that in that day and age, but whatever. Some concessions must be made. Hiya, Buck. How are you? 
Your review of Jurassic Park was the first time I really started taking you more seriously as a film reviewer. Well, thank you, music. Um, although I don't, I, I, I don't really aspire to be taken seriously or be considered a film reviewer, and I think too many people on YouTube do that. I, I, I'm a guy with a YouTube channel. That's all I am. But thank you. Ooh, quite foreboding. I could have got some more ammo if I hadn't come down here first. Every July, peas grow there. You really mean that? No, you don't really mean every July. When I say that, I mean in the sense it was more intellectual and thoughtful than the other reviews I saw. From oh yeah, yeah. Well, that was that was the uh, the favorite movies thing I did was great because I didn't have to use that. The confused Matthew thing. I didn't. I could just be myself. I like. I like those. I like doing this a lot more. Oh God. Oh, he could still be okay, right? You could live without your bottom half, right? Guys, I love this series. I love Resident Evil. This is my number one. I've been playing Fallout 76 forever, but this is just... Huh. Okay. This I remember. Okay, we ran past him. Run, 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 run. We'll see if I can get past the fuck faces over here. Jesus, they're everywhere. I did it. Yes, yes, always. Might do a video response to your Last of Us stream. I got some things to say. Well, you could just talk to me. I mean, you, you could do a video response. That's fine. But uh, you, you can just talk to me about it if you like. I mean, it's hard. I know it's hard to do one person doing voice and another person doing typing. Thanks, Marvin Grubb, Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I could. It's okay, Leon. You'll be a cocky son of a bitch one day. I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Does anyone know what started this? Not a clue. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Oh, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. Not a lot to say. Well, unfortunately, I'm not really sure that there's enough in that stream, first stream I did to do an actual, like, video response. I didn't play very much of it. I'm not going to stream the rest of it. I, you could do it if you want, but I, I, I don't know wh how much there would be to say for a stream that, uh, that brief. Good news. We can get you to hospital. No, no, I am not... I'm not just gonna is my opinion on the 2002 the Sam Raimi Tobey Maguire Spider-Man film the same? Yes, it is. I think it's a wonderful film. I'd come with you, but I just know you now. Uh, Are you afraid your party has been canceled? Stop. I like what they did with Marvin. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. Take it out. Or you will 
Run. Got it. Oh, you'll see. Okay, well, I hope you have fun. We got the combat knife. Uh, before I do anything, I'm going to go get myself some ammo. You know, I can't talk about trail. i got to go sit. Okay, well, it was good seeing you. I saw 2002 and I thought Spider-Man 2. You're talking about the first Spider-Man. No, my, my opinion on that remains the same as well. Alright. Me either, Leon. Me either. Gonna store the knife. I unlocked all these infinite ammo weapons and I never used them because I'm too proud. You should try streaming tofu mode. Oh, I've done that before. Yeah, I should do it again. Some of those tofu uh, runs can be tough. <laughs> More ammo. I'm wondering if there's a way I can... No, there's not. Right now we don't need to be too careful, but we do need to board up these windows eventually. Yeah, what's up with this guy? I do miss the liquor in that scene. Yeah, I do too. I really would like to play the original. Oh, wait, wait. Did I get? Did I actually get lost? Oh no, no, no. The door's right here. I did. I did get a little lost. Man, it's been a long time. I used to be able to speed run this. Like you wouldn't frickin' believe. And now I can't. I did like Willem Dafoe's performance. Yes, I did. Alright, now these guys I'm gonna try to take out. Should be him down, but you never know with these fuckers. I also gotta take this one out. Yes! Success! This son of a bitch over here gives us some real problems. Alright, I'm getting headshots left and right, my friends. Lightning strike thrice. Now get away from me! Okay. That wasn't 
so bad. I know how to use gunpowder. And I used to I used to have all the combinations memorized. I don't anymore. I was gonna see if that jogged any memories. It did not. However, I do remember how this puzzle works. It's the letters. Hello there, Ben. How are ya? Alright, upgrade. Boom. Now some of these we can open right now, and some of these we can't. I'm doing pretty all right, you know, just hanging in there trying to survive the, zo the zombie apocalypse. So we can open everything up to... We can't open anything that has a two or a three. I have not seen Joker, no. So we got some film there. These we can't open yet. What can we do over here? 108, which will give us shotgun shells. Shells too. Oh, do how am I thinking? Can't we can't open anything over here because it's two. Come on, fellas, you're losing your heads. Yeah, I might actually go out of my way to see Joker and talk about it here on a stream. I think some, a lot of people would like that. There's a leaf blower outside my window. I don't know if you guys are picking it up. I think it's network sound. Yes. This I know. I wish I had a little more ammo than I do. Holy crap! Look at that! Did you see that? That was pure skill. Son of a bitch. Damn, I am capping off headshots like a mad person.
this one's tough. How many times have I played this game? Oh my gosh, I've played this game so many damn times. But not for a while, which is what makes this fun. Alright, we got shotgun shells for the shotgun we don't have yet. I don't remember the combination to that. We got our friend here. We can't go in there yet. Okay, so this button here may allow us to access some more in the armory. Ignore that son of a bitch. Okay, so now we have two. Boom, and now we got more shotgun shells. So now we're gonna go get ourselves a key. And then hopefully we'll get ourselves a shotgun. a fuck face over here, but there isn't. Oh. I also don't remember... I think on the harder difficulty... What? I think on the harder difficulty they don't give you a... an extra pack. Oh, that was a waste. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, they don't. There's usually an uh, an upgrade for your inventory here, but not on this difficulty setting. Oh yeah, by all means, what is your, what is your, what do you make of 2001 A Space Odyssey? Tell me. Town with her. You can get to that courtyard through the second floor, east side. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. Poor Marvin. Okay, so now our job is to get three 
uh, thingies to open up a thing. Basically, it's about evolution of man and technology and the competition between the species for survival. Yes, I've heard that interpretation before. Alright, we're gonna get this key. Whoops, I'm gonna get this key out of my inventory. Still got the instincts. Uh, combine. I think this is just a brochure explaining why there's a bunch of weird shit in the police station. Because otherwise it don't make no sense. I don't think we have any combinations yet. We do not. They put the hand, we put the book in the hand, and we put the hand on the thing, and the thing does the thing, and it's beautiful. It's a switch. We got the red jewel, which we won't need for a while. But we will need this weapons key card. And this we don't need. Now, we are free to go get our shotgun. Actually, I left some stuff in here. Oh no, I didn't even go in there. Oh, that's right. That's right. Okay, I'm I'm getting ahead of myself. That's where we. That's when we do the uh, uh, the trigger bomb and all that. Marvin hasn't turned yet. How much space do I have? Okay, I'm gonna have to store some junk. spaces. If I'm careful... A lot of the ideas in the film keep repeating themselves over and over in a cycle. Okay. Uh, this is probably a mistake. I should probably have left that herb behind. In fact, I am going to leave this herb behind. So I'm just going to pick up a f another one. Or is that the red herb? No, I'll... damn it. You gotta be Batman when you play Resident Evil. You gotta have lots of prep. Oh, 
Oh, it is a red herb. I mean, a green herb. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I knew I should have left that damn thing there. Another poor bastard. For example, there's a scene of the caveman all taking shelter at night together, hearing sounds of stuff Claire. that scared them. Hold on. Yes, that there. is true. Okay. Uh oh. It's getting a little warm. It's so nice to see you. How are you doing? And in the future, we got same with people being afraid of the rumors of what's going on in Lunar Space Station and Hall. I don't remember anyone being afraid of anything in that film. Everybody was pretty low-key. Um, even when Hal was flipping out, they stayed relatively calm. And Hal 9000 started to do the same. Now, Hal was afraid. Yeah, Hal was afraid. But that's a that's a that's a pretty uh. Uh, broad thing to say oh there's the people in the beginning were afraid and then later on people are also afraid and that's somehow a theme I don't I don't get that that's that's now pretty ambiguous oh we're gonna get through it we're gonna get through it Marvin got a situation here Surrounded by zombies. Marvin, do you copy? Marvin! Damn it. Marvin can't hear you, Leon. Now, if I'm careful, I should be able to do this without much fuss. Shit, I really do need more room. Well, this will help things. Wouldn't mind having that flashbang. Damn it. This I can come back for. Shit. So much for the flashbang. The RE engine is a hell of a thing. It's damn, damn, damn good. Seen the Joker in about two hours. Oh, cool. Let me know how it is. No spoilers, of course, but um, I'm very curious. Okay, this is going to give us some trouble. I did not board up the windows. So we got fuck faces running around. I should only have to shoot and kill one. Oh, I'm wrong. No, 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 no,
past him. I was wrong. Oh, that was dicey. It was full of dice. <sighs> and they are not nice. No, they're not afraid, like, losing their minds, but before uh, the scene in the movie, the guy we watch going has a conversation with people on the orbit station. Yeah, that's true. I guess that's that's an interpretive thing, though. I don't know that that's necessarily what Kubrick wrote. That's just saying that people were afraid here and people are afraid there. So that's a theme. Uh, because the monolith in the moon is being covered up by people that found it with rumors. That, yeah, but I, do, I don't really remember... Um, if that was the aim, I think that was um, very poorly communicated and not done very well. Locker room. Cap. Okay, we're going to go do that. Oh, wrong way. Oh, no, it's not. Hang on. Store this. We're gonna need at least one flashbang later on. Oh, it's silly me. I could have gotten rid of this the whole time. Well, now we have two slots. I don't even remember what's in here. Whoops. Oh, that's good. What in God's name indeed. Well, this we'll have to come back for. This is Wesker's office. 9.15.7. There we go. That's what we want. Why is it that whenever you stream, there's always someone in the chat who wants to strongly argue about something? Well, you know, because that's just the nature of the, the reviews I used to do. I understand that.
Did you ever play The Evil Within? Yes, I did. It was uh, it was okay. It's not it's not one of my favorites, but it was it was all right. I'll keep one first aid spray on me for protection, just because it's been so long. <clears throat> do this a different way. And I'm not doing that. Daniel, did you silently read what I wrote about Spider-Man 3? Hang on. Must have missed it. Uh, copy paste if you can. Wait, was it? What was it again? Nine fifteen seven. Nine fifteen seven. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Inventory upgrade. Ooh. Useful. Okay, so here's how we're going to do this. I've seen a video essay where the guy making it was kind of an apologist for Spider-Man 3 because Spider-Man 3 is about Peter Parker falling into the sin of pride and losing his empty his empathy for most of it. Yeah, I think that's what they were going for. I just think they they utterly utterly failed. I kind of remember this, I think, but I kind of don't. Okay, lion, leafy thing, bird. Medallion number one. And now we place... Marvin's not going to give us any trouble right now. So I'm going to clear this place out before I move on to the next one. I was right not to trust it. Okay. And last but not least... power lifted that dude. I thought dead bodies were supposed to be frail. Okay, so we move this. Get ourselves some extra ammunition. And now, we get number two. So this is fishy thing, scorpion, water jug. Boom. Yeah, I'll take that. 
don't have the key for that yet. I will take this combat knife. Okay, this area is now clear. Alright, we're almost there. I did watch the Netflix Death Note, uh, the little movie thing they did. I thought it was atrocious. Okay, so this is part three. Actually, I'm gonna need a flashbang. Daniel, when are you going to see Joker? That's a good question. I might see it on Monday. Mel D, thank you so much for the $5 donation. Cheat yourself and see Joker. Well, thank you. Thank you kindly. Really appreciate it. I may very well see it on Monday. Felicity Smoke from Arrow is physically attractive, but her personality isn't. Um, well, she's... I don't know about the physically attractive thing. I like I like her personality. Do I listen to pod... No, I'm not really a podcast person, I have to say. Ghostbusters was a comedy about undergoing uh, underdogs becoming heroes in the old American dream way. Yeah, they kind of did a startup business about, about ghosts. Uh, it was a very interesting idea. I feel like I'm wasting too much ammo. I'm definitely wasting too much time. But this is not a speed run. Nope, I don't remember it. document over here? Oh yeah, it's just a note. Hurry, 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 hurry! We're going to need to equip this. Oh, he's up. I don't want him to be up. We want you to be down. I think he's down. <sighs> Woman, arrow, snaky thing. Oh my god. <laughs> Whew. That could have been bite. Okay, that went off without a hitch. Barely. We're still good. 
Patrick has also said that Joel, Schum Joel Schumacher has nothing to apologize for with his Batman, but it's empty platitudes if you dislike Patrick H. Willems. I wouldn't know about that. I just I don't I don't know that Joel Schumacher apologized for anyone who was disappointed. He didn't really apologize for the film. <laughs> because he had heard that a lot of people didn't like it. Have you seen any of Terrence Malick's film? I don't know. Um, I'd have to... You'd have to tell me what they are. It's also about Vagman becoming a better person by having to deal with something serious. That's it. That's our way out. Hmm. Lieutenant Branagh. Never thought about that. Marvin. Nah, Marvin's too go. far gone, man. We need to get you to a hospital right now. No, no, I... Uh, save yourself. Come on, I've got you. Go! No! Look, we can still make it out of here together. We just can... It's too late. I tried, Leon. But I could stop it. We can't let this thing spread. It's on you now. Just go! I understand. Hello, Esper. It's going really well. It's going better than I thought it would. I'm playing it on the hardest difficulty setting, and I haven't played in a while, and it's still going well. really surprised me too. I had a feeling it was going to be good, but man is it good. It is a good game in its own right. I'm not going to use the infinite combat knife. I'm too proud. Okay, that looks about right. I am going to make this my first save. And I believe I'm going to end things here, and we'll pick it up again with the first boss fight. Alright, thank you all for tuning in. This has been... I don't know why I did that. I'm just going to have to do it again on the next stream. This has been Resident Evil 2, the first uh, little bit of it. And we'll do this again soon.
See you there.